Thank you very much, uh, Mr. President. Uh, thank you for uh, giving me the floor, and thank you for convening this very timely uh, roundtable. Um, COP28 uh, represented a, a turning point in the global efforts uh, to fight climate change. After 30 years of uh, climate diplomacy, uh, we agreed uh, on a new roadmap. We sent a new signal of greater uh, climate ambition. Uh, the pathway is clear. We need to transition away from fossil fuels, and we must uh, triple renewable capacity by 2030. So now we must walk the talk and do our homework, both domestically and through partnership. To meet our commitments, we must strengthen international cooperation for a just and equitable energy transition. The priorities of developing economies are clear and uh, legitimate. President uh, Aswani, you, you are committed to, to growing your economy and lifting your people out of poverty. You are concerned with ensuring access to electricity and creating opportunities for your people. Fortunately, as uh, Mauritania's commitment to green energy clearly shows, climate action is part of the solution. Betting, Mr. President, on renewables will not only allow you to reach uh, your goal of providing universal access to electricity to the people of Mauritania by 2030, it will also allow you to de decarbonize your mining operations, which constitute around 70% of your exports and about a quarter of your GDP, leading to significant cost reductions and enhanced security of supply by minimizing reliance on diesel and heavy fuel oil imports. And green hydrogen should play a key part Mauritania, and I'm also telling this to the business representatives uh, that join us here today, thank you very much for your participation, is uh, extremely well positioned to become a regional hub for green hydrogen production. Green hydrogen will be crucial in ensuring the stability of energy supply and a backup energy vector. It will also prove a key in decarbonizing hard to abate sectors where electrification may not be uh, viable. However, the large scale uh, production of green hydrogen is only possible if countries that have both land uh, availability and significant potential for renewable generation. Spain, my country, is one of them. The hydrogen economy could contribute 32 billion euros per year to Spain's GDP and maintain more than 80,000 jobs during its development. So there's huge opportunities for our countries. Mauritania, like Spain, Mr. President, I do believe this, also fulfills both conditions. It is no co coincidence that it has by far the largest pipeline of renewable hydrogen projects in sub-Saharan Africa. But for these projects to become a reality, you need uh, the ecosystem and the enabling investments. For instance, by 2030, Mauritania will need up to 16, one six gigawatts of renewable energy uh, production to support its announced hydrogen projects up from less than one gigawatt today. This will require uh, ma major investments uh, and the commitment of private companies to complement and multiply the efforts that we, the Mauritanian government, the European Union institutions, and also the Spanish government and the Spanish uh, companies are making. This is why, Mr. President, we want to partner with you under the Global Gateway Initiative to build local value change, uh, create quality jobs, retain economic and social added value here in your country. After all, our relations must be balanced and based on common objectives 
from which we, we both benefit. The development of renewable energy in Mauritania is clearly one of them, Mr. President. In order to encourage trade and investments with Mauritania, we are making available from my country up to 200 million euros in financial support over the next five years through different instruments. And this will facilitate the development of green hydrogen projects with the participation of Spanish companies, which are global leaders in the field of renewable energy. Such projects will, uh, I believe, enable social progress, progress, sorry, job creation and economic growth in your country. And at the same time, the development of clean hydrogen and the decarbonized extraction of minerals is also in Europe's interest as we seek uh, to green our economies and diversify our supply chains. In the hugely volatile world we live in, we need partners that uh, share our vision of a greener, a more sustainable and more equitable future, partners like uh, Mauritania. So please count on the Spanish government, the Spanish uh, private companies in this path to a new paradigm of just and sustainable development. Thank you very much.